What's up YouTube? It's your boy Adel Tone and I'm back at it again with another video. And this time I want to talk about the new weapon that recently just dropped today in Destiny. Uh, Destiny 2 to be specific. It's called the Traveler's Chosen. And obviously this is not a weapon that we haven't seen before. It's a weapon that was in the beginning of the Destiny 2 game. Uh, it started off as just a regular basic common weapon. But then they made it and brought it back as an exotic. And it got new perks, new abilities, new stats. It's great. I love how it has great impact, great stability, great handling, great reload speed. And all around, they just updated the weapon and they gave it some new perks as well. So without further ado, let's get into what this weapon can actually do. You feel me? So this is the Traveler's Chosen right here. It comes with quick dot sass. A gradual sidearm sight greatly increases handling speed and slightly increases stability. Uh, armor piercing rounds. Rounds cause extra damage to combatants, shields, and over penetrates targets. Slightly increases range. Then you have the intrinsic trait. The intrinsic trait is final blows with this weapon grants stacks of gathering light, which is called gathering light. If you long press the X button to reload, it consumes uh, stacks, which grants melee, grenade, and class ability energy based on the number of stacks that you already have. So if you stack up to 10, you can really pretty, pretty much reload everything. Uh, and then it has Gift of the Traveler. If you keep those stacks, each stack of Gathering Light improves this weapon's reload, handling, and target acquisition. So every stack of light that you keep, it keeps it, uh, it's, uh, it improves everything. And then it has Short Action Stock. This weapon is especially easy to grip, rates, uh, greatly increases handling speed. So overall, if you keep those stacks of light continuously going, the bottom line is you're going to have like a weapon that has great handling, great stability, and it just in, in range and everything, and it just improves the stats as you gather light. That's ridiculous. Not to mention, think about the possibilities that you can have with uh, this weapon. If you choose to uh, you know, go all the way up to 10 stacks of light and you consume it in order to get your abilities back, Think about the different builds you can create with that, especially if you want to co consistently get back your uh, class ability. Maybe you want to consistently get back your grenade or your melee. Yeah, like it, just like think about it. In the exotic, and this exotic weapon can go with so many different armor pieces and other legendary weapons that can, you know, boost this ability. It's ridiculous of what you can do with it. The like, possibilities are pretty much endless for the builds. And now, I also must admit, this is not a weapon strictly for like just PVE. Even though it sounds like it, it's a good PvP weapon too. And though I'm not the best in PvP, I did enjoy using this weapon in PvP. Like, every Guardian you kill with this weapon automatically gives you a 3 stack for light and gathering light, I mean. And like, usually when you do, and in PvE, for, uh, you know, it's only 1 stack for any enemy, which is fine. Because, you know, you, is, you can kill multiple enemies with this weapon. But the fact that it get, gives you three stacks for every enemy you kill in PvP is ridiculous. It's kind of broken. And the weapon is nasty. And then you got to think about it. Every stack you get already gives you increased uh, uh, handling, accuracy, and all that other stuff. And not to mention reload speed. Like, it's a deadly weapon to have. And it smacks. The weapon smacks hard. So, like, it's a very fun weapon to use in PvP, in my personal opinion. Like when, you know, you decide to pair it with like maybe a sniper or something like that. Especially if you're like a, uh, something like in like a hunter or a warlock. Like, you know, hunter, you can be quick and agile. H uh, warlock, you can be kind of quick and agile if you do the, the Icarus dodge and everything. It's, it's a fun weapon to use for sure. But yeah, so that's my opinion on the weapon. I really like it. I'm glad I went and got it. The greatest thing about this weapon is like, is you know, it comes with different perks that are very customizable with different armor sets and stuff like that so you can create and customize different builds with this weapon that's surrounding what you do you know your, your gameplay or your games play style i should say and not to mention this weapon is relatively easy to get like think about it all you got to do is the exotic quest that you get from savala for the you know extraction mission you know that's ridiculous like it, it's very easy to obtain as soon as you finish all that and you do everything on the different planets he gives it to you flat out not that hard so if you want this weapon and you think it's a good uh, weapon to have go ahead and grab it it's definitely a fun weapon to use in my opinion but you know that's just me but other than that as i always say i'm your boy ideal tone and i just made it known later